Hello my beautiful Virgos, how are you today? Welcome to the channel. This is an energy update reading. The new love readings were posted last week. We also have, well my ex return is a <clears throat> time stamped reading that I posted over the weekend. So you might want to check those out. So let's see what the energy update is for Virgo and love. Let's see here. Okay. So... The Six of Earth, look at you. I like the Six of the Earth. It really shows that you are giving to a relationship. Uh, you're enjoying your time in that relationship. You want to give more. You want to grow a relationship with someone that you're very close to. Could be Earth sign energy. The Ace of Air. You see the truth for what it is. You see the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. And that is very powerful energy during a love reading because it really speaks to manifesting love in its best form the nine of air says that you are worried about something you're up in your head you're not sleeping really well i see that this relationship could be on your mind but i also see other things we see there's a lot going on in your life right now virgo we have the tower card so you're feeling very unsettled you feel as though you need a, a strong foundation that there's something about the foundation that perhaps is not sturdy enough the six of fire you want a victory you plan on a victory looks as though you may have had some sort of disagreement now the tower card can also mean just something that's very surprising that has you worried but we do see victory okay so the seven of air oh ouch so now we have the nine of air the tower and the seven of air i would have to say virgo that you are very very concerned about something that you think is dishonest that's happening in the relationship the queen of air you're very much uncomfortable with a Libra energy the Queen of Air is usually I call it the Judge Judy card but she's very benevolent she's very wise this is a person who's very sweet and very kind hmm you're very much in your head about this a five of water feeling sad you're feeling sad you feel as though you owe somebody an apology something that this person did is making you actually either aware of something that you haven't shared or come clean with or you feel as though they owe you an apology but the energy is interesting okay patience virgo you absolutely want this to work out you are very much settled in this relationship this is something that you want you have the patience for it you have the fire in your belly for it the seven of earth says that you are very much happy to invest in the relationship the hermit card speaks well virgo there you are in your own reading you're really looking for answers right now the Ace of Earth, you are going to make a very significant offer to this person. I've been It's been coming up in the readings so that the past has been very much an energy that's been coming into the present energy of the reading. Okay, so let's see what it is that you're worried about. We're going to ask for clarifiers here on this, on this Tower, Nine of Air, Seven of Air, Five of Water. I feel as though it's past energy that's still haunting you is the way it's coming up. Observer. Okay, so you're watching the situation very closely with your person. You're watching them. They seem to be very happy in the relationship. Sometimes we can borrow trouble. Okay, let's see. You don't want them to become unhappy, though. The thinker, okay, those are good energies. I like those energies. Now let's look at the outcome of your reading for the time that we are looking at. Okay, it is a timeless reading, but we are publishing that early the second week in September. Okay, so let's see. Transformation, okay. So it does look like the two of you went through a breakup or you were separated for a long time. And the reason you were separated was there was some sort of apology that was owed, something that happened that was a little bit raw. 
Nine of fire, you both have fire in your belly for this relationship. Transformation has been completed. It is successful. That is a death card. That is your outcome. That it is successful because two of you, two warriors are standing strong and in their power for the relationship. The strength card, your outcome is absolutely the strength card. So it does speak to the fact that you may have some feelings that there were secrets at work kept. There may be something that... Virgo, I really feel as though you're almost worried that it could have been you that wasn't so, so upright in the relationship. Now, I don't really see anything negative hugely here. I do think that there were a lot of misunderstandings. I'm going to go ahead and clarify this. Why do we have the Nine of Swords, the Queen of Earth? Okay. It does look like stability though. I like the Earth Queen. Why is a tower card here? Page of Water. Somebody was immature. One person was much more mature than the other. So we have an Earth Queen and the Queen of Pentacles and we have the Page of Water. So it shows that there was no stability in the early phases of this relationship. What happened with the Seven of Air? Were there any actual lies told or what was the scoop on that? The moon card, confusion. I don't really get lies were told. I get that there were misunderstandings about the relationship and how the relationship would be experienced by both of you. It looks like you didn't you thought you had an agreement with this person, but it really wasn't settled. The Queen of Air, why is it here? Ten of Earth. Virgo, it looks like you're almost worried that your person thought you were going to get married before and that you didn't. The Six of Air, they moved away from you, and now you've gone through this transformation. Tell us about the transformation. What is it about? Is How solid is the transformation is actually what we need to know. King of Earth, there we go. So two of you are on the same page. I do think that you are having one of those periods of time in which you're letting the old things that happen haunt this part of the relationship. It's very beautiful. You have the Queen of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles. We, do, we no longer have the mismatch of the Page and the Queen. We have the Queen and the King. That's a transformation. Somebody stepped up. Masculine energy stepped up regardless whether it was the feminine or the masculine. You now have a very clear-cut desire. You've moved into this earth sign energy, the Ten of Coins. It's a very strong foundational card. You transformed the Tower card into the Ten of Pentacles. The Six of Airs, you've moved away from problems. And that is, and you, you have the strength to do it. Your relationship was very strong. The love was very strong. It was a lot of happiness. Let's see where you're both at in your love journey. So Virgo, you're having, well, you know, Virgo is a sign of the worrier. I will absolutely say that. In your love journey, you see this person is very beautiful inside and outside. You're dropping into your heart space, Virgo. You're a little bit worried about falling in love because of, you know, some things that happened in the past with this person. Look at that. The angel of Jupiter has awakened your heart and fire and ice. So you're very logical one minute, you're very passionate the next. We have two more cards here. Shakti, ah, so you feel as though your person is a very wise person. Yeah, you're falling. You're like a feather, you're falling. You're falling for this person, Virgo. Oh, it's okay, you're safe. I see you as being very safe. Let's get just a little bit of sacred destiny energy here for you. I don't want you to ever leave a reading where you feel uncertain. Okay, let's see what we have for the sacred destiny. We have fulfillment, happiness and fulfillment. See, there's your transformation. Your change is beautiful. Your change is a beautiful change. It's a beautiful balloon flying into the sun. We also have delight in the relationship. Patience, okay, that's that patience card there. So both of you are very patient and purification. 
so that that's very much the phoenix rising from the ashes your relationship with a strength card with purification really beautiful virgo you can take a chill <laughs> i think you're worried about something that happened in the past and it looks like everything's really beautiful all right i'm gonna leave it there thank you Bye bye